the Spielmann Gambit Trap. This is an amazing trap that White can play in the Scandinavian variation of Alec Hines defense. So let's check it out. White opens up with e4, knight to f6, attacking this e4 pawn and this is called Alec Hines defense. Knight to c3, defending the pawn and now d5, this is the Scandinavian variation. We have e5 attacking this knight and in this position there are a few moves where uh, you can push this d pawn to attack the knight. However, in this specific variation, we are looking at knight f to d7. And white pushes e6. This is the Spielmann's gambit. Let's check out what happens if black accepts this gambit. f captures e6. This is the main line of this trap. And now you can see that the light squares around the king are weak. And we have to figure out a way to attack this king. You can straight away bring your light square bishop however that hinders the development of your dark square bishop and your queen to some extent so in this specific variation we will try d4 first knight to c6 attacking this d4 pawn and now knight to d3 yet again giving away this pawn now this is a kind of a poison pawn and if black tries to grab this poison pawn it will be a checkmate. Knight captures d4 and now it's a mate in 3. Queen to h5 check. This king has nowhere to go. And now the only option g6. And here there are two ways to checkmate. You can either capture this, queen, uh, this pawn by the queen or by the bishop. Let's try the most pleasing way. Queen captures g6 check, sacrificing the queen, but not really. H captures g6 and now you can see the killer move. Bishop captures g6 check mate. So this is what happens if black becomes greedy and tries to grab the poison pawn. Now in this variation, after let's say e6, what if black does not accept this gambit and moves the knight to knight to f6? Here we can happily capture e captures f7 check, king captures f7 and now developing this knight, knight to f3. Here usually black tries bishop to g4 kind of pinning this knight, however this is just a relative pin as we say. Knight to e5 wins the game because you can see that we are forking the king and this bishop and this is a winning position for white so friends that was spielman gambit trap in the scandinavian variation of alec Hines defense do let us know if you like this trap thank you